What is up, Polka fam? Polka Dalt here. Happy Sunday. I see some of you guys are already going hard in the chat. What's up, BB Hawks? What's up, Julian? Polka Chubbies, of course. Uh, I hope this video finds you well and you guys are all ready for Christmas. Me, myself, uh, had to do some Christmas shopping earlier and we didn't get everything, but you know, we still got tomorrow to make that happen. So, uh, anyways. We are going to be going hard on some Champions Path today. Uh, we're going to be opening up over a Booster's Box worth of packs. Uh, we have 11 V-Box sets here. Uh, I took the liberty to go ahead and get them all unboxed uh, before the video started just because I know you guys don't like seeing that just as much as I don't like opening them. So I figured I'd get them all ready to go right here. Uh, BB Hawks, you're at the gym. What's up, my dude? Yeah, we will uh, we'll definitely motivate you. Uh, we are hunting for those Zards. So, um, yeah, don't fly off the treadmill though, man. You might get hurt and that would make for a very bad Christmas. So, uh, I do have something else planned a little bit later in the video. I found today actually at Party City. So keep your eyes out at Party City. They have some good stuff as well. Um, but I just want to make a quick announcement. I did pin something up in the top. I will be, uh, announcing my next pack break here, uh, very shortly um but that link will take you directly to my website where you can order them well i guess i'll just get into it now so we will be doing uh champion's path shiny star v and darkness ablaze so your one order will get you one of each uh it's gonna be the ultimate modern set pokemon or modern set charizard hunt if you will uh because you know you can get two from champion's path Two from Shiny Star V, and then you can get the original VMAX Charizard out of Darkness Ablaze. So, uh, I think it's going to be really fun. Uh, it is going to be set for after the holidays, so you have plenty of time to place your order. Um, there will be about 80 or 90 packs of each available. So, uh, definitely scoop them up before they're all gone. Um, it's going to be it's gonna be a fun time. It's set for uh, January 9th, so it's going to be the first pack break of the year. So, I'm super pumped for that. But uh, I'm just waiting for some few more people to get in here. So, Julian, how are you doing, man? Uh, hoping you're having a good Sunday. Let me know if you uh, came up on anything Pokemon-wise here over the weekend. Um, I really didn't. The only thing I did was I snagged up a bunch of these uh, Hatterene and Dove Wool boxes because I want another Shiny V Charizard. So, um, it's going to be fun. But let's get cracking into it. I think we're going to start. We're going to go left to right on this. So, um, we have 11 boxes worth, 11, like, V boxes worth of Champion's Path right here. So, um, I felt, I feel really good. I felt some good vibes coming off these boxes when I was opening them. So, let's get into it right now. We're going to start off with the Dreadnought, Dreadnought VMAX. Um, hoping for that Zard. That, wouldn't that be sick if we pulled it first pack? That would be absolutely nuts. Alright, so we'll go one, two, three, four. How's everybody's Sunday though? Uh, did you guys relax? Doing last minute Christmas shopping? Um, starving yourself for the Christmas feast upon us? Let me know in the comments. What's up, a fish? Uh, sacrifice. You want me to sacrifice the energy? Alright, we got this. Uh, fire energy. It is a psychic. I will sacrifice the first fire energy we come across. I'll rip it in half. Or I'll bite it. I'll take a bite out of it. So, um, we got a hop. A choke. Nick it. Trubbish. Hatina. Potion. Vulpix. Rock Rough Reverse. And the dreaded Professor's Research. Let me know in the comments how many packs in you think we're gonna we're gonna have to go before we pull Zard. What's up, Tyler? Yeah, first fire energy is definitely getting sacrificed. I'm gonna say fire energy. And it's another psychic. How weird. Milo. Turfield Stadium. B drill. Scraggy. Well, let me fix this autofocus. There we go. That should be better. Purloin. Machop. Nicket. Trubbish. Zygarde. Reverse. 
and an Eldegoss V. So not too bad, our first V hit of the night. Um, obviously it could be better, but V cards, you know, better than the hollows, 100%, so we're not gonna complain. What's up, Barrett? 20 packs? All right, bet. So we're on pack number two. So that means at the bottom of this stack, it'll be the third pack from the bottom will be pack number 20. So we will see if you are right. If you're right, I'll give you one of the jumbo cards that come with the set. How's that sound? Dreadnought VMAX again. Wow, 10 likes. Thanks, guys. We're doing good on these likes on these videos now. If you haven't liked the video yet um, and you're tuning in, please do me a favor and go ahead and hit that like button. If you are new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. We open mounds of packs here on the regular basis, a couple times a week. Um, and if you're not subscribed, definitely consider hitting subscribe. It's free, it helps the channel out, and you know, if you don't like what you see, you can always unsubscribe. Obviously, I hope you don't, but uh, BB Hawks, I am opening up um, 44 packs. But, you know, if we're having a good time and we want to keep this party going, uh, I have five more boxes that we uh, we might get into. So, if we don't pull the Zard by the end of this stack, we're going to get into five more boxes. So, Tyler, you say 13? All right, bet. Um, Oifit, are you fish? Oh, Dragon Frontiers? No, I don't have any Dragon Frontiers. I would love to get my hands on some, though. But... All right, let's say fire energy. Hey, there we go. All right, so we got to sacrifice this. So I think I'm going to rip it in half and sprinkle it over the stack. That's going to give us the Charizard luck right there. Maybe not in this pack, but it will give us the luck in the packs going forward. BB Hawk, you say pack 34? All right. We, we will see. Milo, Turfield Stadium, Hadena, Kakuna, Rockruff, Vulpix, Potion, a Purloin Reverse, and a Galarian Octagoon. So, didn't the sacrifice didn't work for this pack, but I think it's going to give us. It's going to give us the juice we need in order to pull that Zard. Wow, this is like three out of four packs so far that we've gotten into is Dreadnought VMAX. That's nuts. Let's go Lightning Energy. And it's another Psychic. So th three out of four energies so far have been Psychic. That's pretty crazy. Beedrill, Milo, Absol, Carvana, Potion, Vulpix, Machop, Roly Coley, ooh, and a Psychic Reverse. I do love me reverse energy cards. And a Hatterene Regular Hollow. So, just a fun fact about me, I actually collect reverse energy cards. Um... I have a, I have at least probably two or three hundred of them sleeved up and in top loaders. So, um, I think it's something that down the line they're going to be highly sought after because you know, once the game, once it starts coming back where they're able to host like events and tournaments and stuff like that, who doesn't want some swag in their deck and reverse energies? Like just having a deck loaded re with reverse energies, that speaks for itself. It's like, yo, look at me, like I know what I'm doing. I'm confident enough. To load up my deck with reverse energy so um barrett what do you do with all the pokemon cards that you don't want so we refer to that as bulk so what i do is i sell some of it online um on this place called tcg player um i mean they're not like crazy mounts like 10 to 20 cents depending on the card and then if i don't go that route i usually send it into like an online company and they count your bulk and they sort it and then they pay you for it. So like if you send it 10,000 cards, depending on what it is, you're going to get somewhere between like $200 and $400, um, give or take. And then I just roll that right back in so I can buy more product and make more content. So 
Uh, literally every Pokemon card has a value to it, but obviously some are way more valuable than others. 12 likes. There we go, guys. Thank you so much. One, two, three, four. Let's go water energy. And it's a metal. Pierce. Sonia. Sharpedo. Purloin. Pokeball. Inke. Galarian Zigzagoon. Trubbish. Kaboo. Reverse. And a Zygarde regular hollow. So... We have opened five packs. We've gotten one V-card and four regular rare hollows. So I feel some heat coming. So go ahead and throw some fire in that chat, guys, because we need all the luck we can because we definitely want to pull at least one Zard tonight. If we could pull two, that would literally be insane. One, two, three, four. And if you're here and you're just lurking, let me know that you're here. Um... Preston, if you're there, throw it in the chat. Tyler, I know you're here, man. What about Colton? What about Austin? Where are my day ones at? Let's go with Lightning. And it's a medal again. Thank you, Tyler. Hatterem. Milo. Weedle. BB Hawks, you just made a TCG player account and scanned some cards in. Is it user-friendly when it comes to sending cards in? Um, so... I use the seller portal because like I created a full fledged business for this. Um, what's up, Austin or Offish Poggers? What is what is Poggers? Um, anyways, BB Hawks. Um, so it's a little bit different. There's like a back end inventory system that I go in and manually enter each card. I have I don't actually have the app. Maybe I should get it. That might make my life a lot easier. But it's pretty quirky to figure it out initially. But once you get the hang of it, like. It's one of those things where it's like you know what to do, so then like you just kind of go on autopilot when you're doing it. Um, and I mean, it's people really like if you're selling like some really high end cards, they kind of discriminate based on like your seller rating and stuff. So when you're new, like it's kind of tough, but you really have to competitively competitively price everything. So um, I try to go in and I see what like the people are selling them for, and I usually mark it like a penny or two less. So then mine pops up first. Great Ball. Galarian Opsigoon. No, I'm definitely not a gamer. So please enlighten me so I don't have to make a fool of myself again. Where are you at, Fire Energy? Are you right here? Fire. And a Psychic again. Champion's Path, dropping the Psychic Energies left and right. Suspicious Food Tin, Trubbish, Full Heal, Sizzlipede, Purloin, Ekans, Scorch Reverse, and a Scrafty Regular Hollow. So, the first one, two, the first seven... Well, the first, yeah, the first seven packs we've opened, not the craziest hits, um, but, you know, Champion's Path is such a brutal set. It is, like, I mean, pretty much the only thing it's got going for it, really, are the Charizards, and some of the V and VMAX cards are super cool. Um, oh, this one's got some, uh, I don't know if you can see that, some factory, whatever that is. Uh, looks like an ink blot or something, but... Luckily, that's not on the rare or or the hit, as you want to call it. Um, let's go Grass Energy, and it's a Lightning. What's up, Aiden? What's up, Ariel? What's up, Ryan? How are all of you? Happy almost Christmas. Pierce, Team Yelgrunt, Hop, Purloin, Ekans, Potion, Vulpix, NK, Machoke Reverse, and an Altaria Regular Hollow. So I think we've pretty much gotten almost all of the regular rare hollows that you can out of the set so far. I think we're missing a handful. Um, so hopefully that means that um, 
this next stack is gonna throw some heat at us. Aiden, are you excited for Christmas? How many Pokemon cards do you think you're gonna get? Let's go fire energy. And it's a fighting, I almost said fighting. I'm really trying here guys to, to mix up the energies. So let me know if you prefer it when I just guess fire and I'm wrong almost all the time, or if you actually want me to continue to try and guess it differently. Kaboo. You're super excited? Yeah, man. Christmas is fun. Uh, one of the few things I miss about being a kid. Definitely Christmas. Christmas was my favorite. Ekans. Potion. Vulpix. Inke. Arbok Reverse. And another Scrafty Hollow. You think you're going to get 100? Man. You'd be opening more packs than I do here on the channel. I would love to come help you if you get that many. Yeah, BB Hawks, we gotta switch my uh, my streaming platform um, so that we can get a get the correct energy counter in there. Chubby's actually figured it like figured out what we need to do today, and we just didn't have enough time to get it done today. So uh, we're gonna knock that out as soon as as soon as we're done with the stream. So it should be good to go um, the next time I go live, uh, and we're gonna be adding some other stuff in there. Um, not gonna tell you what it is. I want it to be a secret. I want it to keep kind of keep you guessing, but it's gonna be super cool. So. This, this chat, this channel, the lives, it's going to be so much fun. Uh, what's up, Ryan? I love the name, man. Let's go fire and metal. Great ball. Milo. Turfield Stadium. Carvana. Swablu. Vulpix. Trubbish. Rolling some coal. Leapford Reverse and another Scrafty. Oh, guys. We need all the vibes right now because we are on pack number 11 and we've gotten one hit so far. Granted, I did mix up all the packs. So I'm really hoping that on this dry streak, you know, we're just going to get hit after hit in one of the next stacks. Yeah, it's definitely a Scrafty Night, man. Um, water Energy. Psychic again. Rotom Phone. Absol. Great Ball. Swablu. Scraggy. Carvana. Galarian Zigzagoon. Kakuna. Absol Reverse. And a Grap Block V Full Art. There we go. We finally got a hit number two. And this is a really cool card. Um, not a huge Graplock fan, uh, but I love the artwork. I think it's really, uh, really unique. I love the background. BB Hawks. Oh, you saw my poker rev video? Which one? I've been in a few of his openings and there was one that was just absolute, like, I think I ordered... I ordered over a hundred packs and they were spread out between four different orders. And it was like first order, meh, second order. Like I got two hits out of 30 packs and then two orders later, bam, we pulled the rainbow rares art. Like hashtag Daltazard was born then. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's literally the one that I'm just talking about. Yeah. That was nuts. Wasn't it? I will not be doing a pack sacrifice. I'm sorry. I do not believe in bending full cards, full packs of cards, just because um, in the off chance, with my luck, there would be a Charizard in there. So um, I'm cool with sacrificing energy, sacrificing Scrafties, and all that stuff, but not full packs, man. Um, let's go Lightning. And it's a fire energy. That's a good sign. Uh, BB Hawks, I actually just got my email from um, Beckett that they finished grading it. So I should have that back by the time I do another live opening. So I'm going to open that return live on stream. Um, I did not 
like you can go in and look and see what it is i didn't go in and look and see what it is like i want to be surprised so that's what i did when i graded the uh the shiny v's so uh you guys will definitely be able to see my reaction on camera and it's gonna be it's gonna be nuts uh because that card was absolutely immaculate so i would be surprised if it got anything less than a 9.5 but uh we will have to see trubbish full heel sizzlipede purloin ekans inke scrafty scrafty again yikes well at this rate i feel like we are going to have to definitely be ripping into those other five boxes which i don't think you guys are gonna mind i'm not gonna mind because you know that's 20 more packs so let's go with water energy and it's fire again all right i'll rip this scrafty after after this and sprinkle it over over the next uh next pack bade kaboo lightbird inke Galarian Zigzagoon, Trubbish, Full Heal, Sizzlipede, Absol Reverse, and a Hatterene Regular Rare. All right, so we got the All Creamy V Max. We're gonna sacrifice the Scrafty. That ripped really weird. I don't know if you guys have ever ripped a Hollow, but. This is kind of what it looks like after you rip them. Kind of interesting. Um, but. Sacrifice Scrafty to the pack gods. Hopefully they can give us a Zard in this pack. Yeah, no, definitely. I think there's probably like four or five at least in this pile. I've uh, been kind of keeping a mental note. Hey, at least we're not getting Machamps though. But at this point, I'd rather get Machamps than Scrafty. At least Machamp is a pretty solid Pokemon. Oh, Ariel, it's okay. Aiden's all good. I think my chatbot, I fixed it so that it shouldn't delete stuff um, if you hit caps a lot. But, I mean, technology, right? Can't control everything. Okay, Inke on the front. One, two, three, four. If we get a fire energy in the third the third pack in a row, I feel like that's gonna that's gotta mean something. So let's go fire. Psychic again. Sonya, Absol, Vicente, Inke, Galarian Zigzagoon, Trubbish, Full Heal, Sizzlipede, Fire Energy Reverse. Ooh, I'm I got a little I got a little tingly here. And a Galarian Obstagoon. Oh, that's unfortunate. But that is really cool that we got this because I really wanted one of these to send off and get graded so that I can uh, keep it with my uh, shiny V and also the rainbow rare. And this one looks like it's pretty perfectly centered. It's a little top heavy on the back. Probably the only, the only Poketuber out there that thoroughly examines reverse energy cards, but I'm weird like that, so. Offish, I do not have a Discord yet, but I am definitely gonna make one. It's been on my list. So um, by the time I throw up another video, I, I should have that taken care of. So stay tuned for that. Um, Oop, free code card for you guys. There you go. When you grab it, just let me know so that. One, two, three, four. Chubby's is probably over there with his phone ready to go. Just waiting for me to mess up. We play the TCGO. So if you guys play the TCGO, um, Chubby's, if you can throw in both of our usernames in chat, if you guys play, add us both as friends. We'll definitely play with you. So it's super fun if you haven't played it. Um, and if you have a stack of code cards just sitting around like I do, it's it's pretty fun to redeem them because you actually get to open the packs online um and it kind of feels like if you can't get your hands on any packs in real life just because like scalpers and they're sold out everywhere 
uh, it feels like you're actually opening it um, in real life, so that's pretty cool. All right, let's go fire energy. Leaf. Give me just a second here, guys, actually. I have this... I cut my finger on my snowboard yesterday, and it's kind of... It was bugging me that it's just chilling there, but... Kaboo. Absol. Beedrill. Swablu. Inke. Hatiana. Kakuna. Weedle. Suspicious Food Tin Reverse. And a Zygarde Regular Hollow. Alright. All creamy V Max. Do not let me down, Ryan. Yeah, man. I I love the Reverse Hollow energies. I don't know why. Like ever since like they first came out, I've always collected them. All right, this box is weird. So all the code cards are backwards. One, two, three, four. Um, fire energy. Yeah, and I see something in the back. Spoiler alert, I'm sorry. I'm just getting a little getting a little carried away. Great Ball, Absol, Galarian Zigzagoon, Trubbish, Full Heal, Sizzlipede, Purloin, Full Heal Reverse, and a Venusaur V. Not a bad hit. one unfortunately does look a little bit off left to right um, but I don't think people are going out there and grading these Venusaur V's by the droves um, so I also don't think they're worth a whole lot but hey, a V card is a V card and it looks like this one's got some damage on it so I'm glad it wasn't a Charizard um, that is for sure Let's see, is the code card gonna be messed up again? Yep. All right, so you guys are getting four code cards. One, two, three, four. Let's go with lightning. Grass. Beedrill. Rotom Phone. Milo. Swablu. Kakuna. Pokeball. Machop. Atiana, Kakuna Reverse, and a Zygarde Regular Hollow again. 14 likes, not too shabby. Thank you so much, guys. Let me know what you guys think about the uh, the next break. If you missed it, um, if you're just tuning in, or recently you didn't miss it in the, or didn't catch it in the beginning. So the next break that I will be doing will be on January 9th. Um, and we are going to be doing, um, it's going to be three packs per order and it's going to be one champion's path, one shiny star V and one darkness of blaze. So five chances to pull a Charizard, whether it be a, one of the V maxes in either shiny form and shiny star V Rainbow Form and Champion's Path, or regular VMAX in Darkness of Blaze. And then also two chances to hit the Shiny V, one in Shiny Star V and one in Champion's Path. Um, and then I believe there's also a Charizard regular V in Darkness of Blaze. So actually six chances to pull Zard. So I pinned the link um, up in the top of the chat. That'll take you right to the page. Um, it's going to be a good time. And... I, I definitely think that these are going to sell out quick because they are some hot sets right now. So, one, two, three, four. Let's go fire. Ekans. Oops, and I totally messed this up, so I am sorry. I think the hit is going to be right here after Pokemon Center Lady. And it's a Hatterene, so not too shabby. And it was a Psychic Energy. I guess we'll just go through the rest of the cards. Sharpedo, Arbok, Full Heal, Sizzlipede, Purloin. Two more packs and I'll get a hit. All right. So here's pack number one. This pack was opened.
One, two, three, four. Let's go fire energy. And there we go. Beedrill, Milo, Great Ball, Galarian Zigzagoon, Vulpix, Rockruff, Purloin, Galarian Lanoon, Hop, Regular Reverse, and a finally we pull our first Machamp of the night. I don't know why I just got so excited about that. I think I was just more excited that it wasn't, you know, a Scrafty or a Zygarde. All right, so Offish says this is the pack where we're going to get a hit. Can it be a Zard? Is it going to be a Zard? Oh, my. One, two, three, four. And it's a lightning energy. Rotom Bike, Hyper Potion, Sharpedo, Machop, Galarian Zigzagoon, Vulpix, Rockruff, Purloin, Nicket Reverse, and a Full Art Rainbow Rare Pierce. Heck yeah. Offish, how'd you know? All right, tell me, when is the next hit going to be? And um, BB Hawks with these. So I bought these at the PX. Um, so I know that these probably were not tampered with, but sometimes like if I see a box that's like half open, if there's more, I'll buy the sealed one. Like the ones that don't have any imperfections, but sometimes I feel like I don't know. I'm a little superstitious about that because I think that it uh, it might have might be like some sort of good juju or something to buy the crap box. Um, I, the only time I've ever pulled packs that I knew 100% were tampered with was from the Walmart mystery boxes. I literally pulled like I opened three packs and they were just full of energies. So they were resealed. They were glued. Um, I don't think these were tampered with, but yeah, I definitely have had my suspicions before. Um, I've also ordered some Champions Path, like a bulk lot of them, like 36, like back when I first got back into collecting. And I definitely felt like the packs were tampered with and the hits were not good. What's up, Bailey? How are you? Polka Dot? Excuse you. I think you missed an A and an L on that. All right, Gardevoir, pack art. But these, so like if you're watching how I'm, like see how that, I just, I think that that is just like a factory crimping error. Um, Cause that's how this one was too. The one we just pulled this pierce out of. And I feel like if somebody was tampering with them, they wouldn't have left this. Cause this is, you know, it's a decently valuable card. So. Um, but I mean like this, like that's a little weird, but I don't think it's anything to like raise super suspicions about. Um, cause sometimes with champions path, these things open like butter and sometimes they don't, but like, if you look down here on the bottom, you can see where the crimping actually fully went through and up here, it looks like it was, might've been just misaligned a little bit and it just didn't, didn't get that nice seal. One, two, three, four. <clears throat> Let's go with water energy. And it's lightning. Malamar, Great Ball, Hadiana, Kakuna. That's my name now? Okay. Rockruff, Vulpix, Potion, Full Heal Reverse, and an Incineroar V. So again, not a crazy valuable card, but I don't think that this V card would have been left in this pack if it had been actually tampered with. Um, so I feel like we're in the clear. And I'll really, what I really need to convince me though, 
is we need to pull a Zard out of one of those weird packs. So, this is pack number 22. Next energy is fire. All right, bet. Chubbs, let me know if you're claiming these codes. Otherwise, I'm going to claim them as soon as the stream's done. One, two, three, four. So Bailey says fire. Let's see if she's right. Ooh, tough break, kid. Psychic energy, Sonya, Kabu, Fade, Machop, Roly Coley, Carvana, Potion, Rock Ruff, Zygarde Reverse, and a Machamp. Ariel, am I superstitious on where I get my cards? Better pulls from a Walmart than a Target? Um, no, not really. Just because, like, the scalping community here in Colorado Springs is very, very heavy. So, if I find packs anywhere, it's better than finding no packs. Um, I honestly, the Walmarts near me, most of them don't stock Pokemon cards. So, I usually get my stuff from Target, um or from the PX on post. So, and I've the, the few things that I have bought at a local game store, um, that's actually where I got my biggest hits. So, maybe a little bit superstitious because I know that those are not able to be tampered with because they have them literally in glass display cabinets and they're always there. So, like, if somebody was messing with their stuff, they would see it. Um, but, yeah. I don't know. How do you feel about that? Do you prefer getting them at Target versus Walmart or vice versa? Um, I'm curious what you guys have to say about that. Uh, let's go Fire. And it's Psychic again. Great Ball. Absol. Milo. Swablu. Carvana. Galarian Lanoon. Weedle. Inkay. Scraggy Reverse and Marnie Regular Rare. Yeah, I figured you were, Chubbs. You're welcome. Don't say I never did anything for you. LOLs. One, two, three, four. Yeah, Vapes and Capes, you definitely know that you're not getting anything shady when you buy from them. So, um, good call, Ryan. Um, let's go Water. And it's Metal. Absol. Kabu. Choke. Carvana. Ekans. Nicket. Roly Coley. Scraggy. Team Yelgrunt Reverse. And the Galarian Cursal of V. So, not too shabby. Circle K is all trash packs. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure people are probably in there weighing them and stuff. I actually asked the Circle K up here. We have like one or two up here in the springs. And he's like, nah, man, I wish we had Pokemon cards. But, uh, yeah, no, I, I haven't seen any. And I've been working here for a while. And I was like, oh, well, I think that might be piloting it down in Arizona. And he's like, oh, man, I wish I, I worked at that store. He's like, I buy them all. So um, you also got to be careful about dollar store packs, too. Like, if you're going to buy anything from the dollar store, you want to buy, like, a sealed box. Set. Like the, the three packs, like the three card packs. Um, because... Those, like these newer sets, because of these code cards, you can't really weigh them. But the dollar store packs, you 100% can weigh. And there's a lot of like conspiracy theories out there that the employees weigh the packs, buy the ones that have good, like, good weights to them, and then put the rest on the shelf. So uh, let's go lightning and grass. Bailey, you were one off. Sonia, Vicente, Absol, Weedle. Sizzlipede, Swablu, Carvana, Galarian Lanoon, another Reverse Fire Energy, and a Graplock V. Oh, 
Oh, I got super excited right there. Yeah, no, nah, Ariel, we didn't, we didn't get, uh, we didn't get what we wanted on that one. But this one is another one that looks like it's in really good condition. No print lines. Um, the edging or this, uh, it's got a lot of silvering up on the top, so that's unfortunate. But yeah, Ryan, these uh, two reverse fire energies from Champions Path has definitely got to be a good sign that something big is coming. So this is probably the one set I haven't pulled a reverse fire energy from. So I'm pretty stoked that I got two of them. Um, so let's see, what do we got next? We got Galarian Obstagoon. You're calling lightning? All right, Bailey. Yeah, Ariel, I'm hoping. Um, hey, Aiden, I meant to ask you, what's your favorite set? I'm curious. Let's go with, why not, fire energy. Ooh, water. Rotom bike, Sonia, Great Ball, Inke, Pulpix, Potion, Ekans, Purloin, Reverse Dark Energy now, and another Galarian Curse V. What is going on tonight? Looks like we got a good view count going on right now. Uh, if you're new here and you're just stopping in, welcome. My name's Pokedol. We do a lot of pack openings here along with trivia. We do some giveaways. So uh, we're just trying to get to the next level here. Um, if you just stopped in and this is your first time here, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It really helps out the channel. Uh, and if you have not liked the video yet, please go ahead and hit that like button for the YouTube algorithm. It definitely helps get this video out to others. Ariel, Darkness of Blaze, or Aiden, I'm sorry, Darkness of Blaze is your favorite? Heck yeah, that was probably like the one set that got me re back into collecting. Um, so, like, I opened Evolutions here and there, like, throughout the past couple of years, just randomly, but Darkness of Blaze was the first one I went really hard on. Okay, yeah, the first Zard I pulled from there, uh, I pulled like three of the regular V Zards. Um, oh man. I'm really hoping this isn't anything super crazy because I don't know if you can see, but we got whitening on both on all four corners on this one. Maybe we'll have a miscut or something. Um, all right, Bailey, let's go fire. Oof, 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 oof. Vistini, Hatterem, Malamar, Galarian Zigzagoon, Weedle, Purloin. Pokeball, watch this one be the Charizard. Inke, Bade Reverse, and it's just an Altaria regular hollow, so that's okay. But yeah, you see what I'm saying on this one? Like, it's kind of weird. It's on all four corners. So, interesting. All right, Bailey, hit us with the next one. What is it gonna be? Ryan, you need to make sure you go and get that Zard graded. Make sure he holds on to that thing for the rest of his life. Or maybe it'll turn into the base Zard since it was the first VMAX Charizard. Uh, it might be worth a good chunk of change down the line. One, two, three, four. Water, water, water. And we're wrong, fighting. Pokemon Center Lady, Team Yelgrunt, Roly Coley, Trubbish. I think Roly Coley's got to be my favorite Pokemon just because of Roll and Cole. I don't know. I just I can't get over it. Potion, Galarian, Lanoon, Nicket, Roly Coley Reverse, and a Zygarde Regular Hollow. All right, how many we got left in this stack? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. 
So we're coming up almost on 30 packs so far. Haven't gotten anything super crazy. Um, we did get one rainbow rare, so that's super cool. Dark is next. Dark it is. There you go. Hatterem, Sonya, Beedrill, Pokeball, Sizzlipede, Galarian Zigzagoon, Scraggy, Rockruff, Professor's Research, and a Scorch. You know, Offish, I usually... I don't like the word guaranteed when it comes to opening Pokemon cards because, like, I've opened ETBs and I've gotten zero hits uh, for Champion's Path. I've opened double boxes and Hatterene boxes and I've gotten four hits in each box. So... I feel like it's kind of a mystery, like, I think it's a good rule of thumb to go by, but, I mean, you could be right. I mean, I feel like Pokemon's always switching things up just so we don't get too used to things. Um, let's go Lightning, and it's Grass. Rotom Bike, Machoke, Beedrill, Pokeball, Sizzlipede. Galarian Zigzagoon, Scraggy, Rockruff, Milo, and a Zygarde Regular Hollow. This bulk pile is getting real though, fam. Just scoot this into the light real quick so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Yeah, the bulk is real. Literally drowning in bulk. I wish I were that lucky, Offish. Um, sometimes I get really good, good boxes, and sometimes I don't. Um, I will say I haven't gotten anything. I haven't gotten any crazy hits out of a box in probably the last twenty or thirty that I've opened. Um, Psychic. All right, let's see. Grass. Sharpedo. Pokemon Center Lady. Turfield Stadium. Carvana. Potion, Rock Rough, Weedle, Swablu, Pierce Reverse, and a Lycanroc Hollow. We haven't hit that all night. Now I think we've hit pretty much every Hollow, though, in this set. So come on, Pokemon Gods. We've done our sacrifices. Give us the Zards. Give the people what they want. It's okay, I feel like at this point I'm just I'm getting all the bad hits out of the way so that in my box break coming up on the 9th, you guys get some fire. One, two, three, four. Let's go with fire. And it's dark. Rotom Bike. Torpedo. Pierce. Kakuna. Roly Coley. Trubbish. What's up, Polish Rob? How are you, my dude? Galarian Lanoon. Malamar Reverse. Oh, and a full art Galarian Cursal of V. There we go. All right, so Offish, maybe, maybe your luck is rubbing off on me because I believe that was the fourth pack. Rob, we are hunting for another Shiny V or Rainbow Rare VMAX from Champion's Path. So... I am hungry for another one. How's your night been, man? I caught your last stream. Uh, it was good. I was happy with the hits that I got out of that. We're also playing Guess the Energy, and I'm very bad at it. So uh, Chubby's, his sister Bailey, is helping me out and guessing them, and she's actually way better than I am. One, two, three, four. Let's go with, I'm going to say lightning, but I'm waiting to see what Bailey comes in and says. Water. Ooh, and it's dark. All right, we were close. Ooh, yeah. I just ate two right before the stream. What'd you have? I had some, uh, I had a, car uh, yeah, Carl's Jr. Beyond Burger. 
So if you haven't tried one, definitely check it out. Trubbish, Roly Coley, Galarian Zigzagoon, Scrafty, Reverse, and a Lycan Rock, Regular Hollow. Rob, throw us some of your luck, man. You pull some heat on, on your channel. So we we need that luck. We need those vibes for this Zard. So What's up, Andy? What's wrong with me? What's wrong with you? Let's go with fire. And it's a water. Team Yogrunt, Bade, Sharpedo, Nicket, Ekans, Carvana, Swablu, Vulpix, Malamar Reverse, and an all creamy V. Yeah, there we go, man. Thank you. Appreciate you jumping in here, man. It really means a lot to me. It's not lab made meat, Andy. It's made from plants, okay? I'll get down on a good steak, but I love Beyond Burgers. Where are the packs coming from? So I bought these packs um, at the PX. So they had uh, they had a display out there, so. I grabbed 15 boxes, um, and then I get a lot of my stuff um, from local game stores, and then I'm in the process of getting set up with some distributors. So um, going forward, I won't have to be running around like a chicken with my head cut off to try and find product, but uh, energy is metal. Ooh, I'm sorry, Bailey, and it's water. Again, suspicious food tin, the Cinti, Hyper Potion, Purloin, Scraggy, Pokeball, Galarian Lanoon, Hadiana, Hyper Potion Reverse, and a Galarian Obstagoon. Regular rare. <laughs> you know, I used to I used to think the same way, Andy, and then I started trying some of this stuff. And it is honestly like some of it tastes way better to me. Yeah, Rob, I try to mix it up where I get them so that I'm not getting it from the same spot all the time. Like, I'll go to some of my local game stores, grab some stuff from them. Even though sometimes um, sometimes their prices are a little bit more, I definitely firmly believe in supporting, like, the local businesses. I'd rather give them my money than Target or Walmart. Um, Barnes & Noble is a good spot here as well. A lot of people don't know about that. Um, energy is water. Okay. All right, Bailey, I see you. E, and it's grass, and grass beats water too, so that's even worse. I think you're slipping. Bade, Sharpedo, Pokemon Center Lady, Kakuna, Pokeball, Machop, Hadiana, Full Heal, Weedle Reverse, and a Hatterene Regular Hollow. So we are coming down to the last of this stack. Let's see how many is left. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this pack right here will be pack number 35. Yes, BB Hawks, I will be in Arizona this week. I am definitely gonna try and find some stuff. Um, oops. Free code card. There you go. Yeah, BB Hawks, you're gonna. Where are you located exactly in the valley again? I forget. So I'm gonna be staying in Gilbert. Um, so I know most of the stuff around there is gonna be hit pretty hard. I'm gonna try and hit up like Gold Canyon and Apache Junction and maybe um, Casa Grande and see um, see what those WalMarts and Targets look like. Uh, Rob, yeah, no, definitely is. Uh, I've, I've started to build some good relationships with a couple of them. Um, one of them here, Video Game Exchange, he's super cool. Um, he's, he's getting me some Darkness of Blaze 144 count cases, so, um, and that's straight from, like, direct, basically, so, 
That's super cool. It's really nice of him. <laughs> Fighting. Fighting or fire. All right. Ugh. Grass again. Bead drill. Hop. Turfield Stadium. Nicket. Hadiana. Sizzlipede. Nicket. Purloin. Lycanroc. Reverse. And another Galarian Obstagoon. All right, BB Hawks. Yeah, that. I will be in Scottsdale on the 24th in the morning, and then I gotta go. Gotta go get a nice haircut. Um, since I don't trust anybody here in Colorado to cut my hair, I have to literally come home to Arizona to get my hair cut. I can't. I won't. I won't go to anybody else other than my barber. Um, so after that, I'll be free Christmas Eve. Not sure what you're doing, but. All right, Rob saying metal. Bailey, where you at? What's up, Okahandro? Welcome, man. You're all good. Tell the fam I say hello. I think you scared her off, Rob. Come on, Bailey. Where you at? Metal and water. All right. Ooh. Fire's a good sign, though. Pokemon Center Lady, Machoke, Malamar, Machop, Purloin, Scraggy, Full Heal, Hedienna, Professor's Research, Reverse, and another Hatterene. Ryan, yeah, you know we will. 100%. All right, Robin Bailey, hit me with the energies. I kind of like this better with you guys guessing the energies instead of me. Lightning, Rob says. Lightning and dark. All right. Oof. Bailey, you are definitely slipping. Rob, you should have seen her earlier, man. She was literally on point. Like, every three out of four energy she guessed, she was guessing them right. Galarian Lanoon. This teeny. And a Zygarde regular hollow. Again. We haven't got a hit in a while. I feel one coming in this bat in this one. Um, throw out your guesses, everybody. Here's a free energy card. Or, I'm sorry, not energy card, code card. While I'm waiting for you guys to throw your guesses in, I'm gonna I'm gonna hydrate real quick. All right, water, fire, leaf. All right, so we got we got a good variety here. Someone's gonna be right. I'm gonna say dark. Oh, and Ryan is the winner. B drill, hop. Ryan, you got a camera set up here or what? Gonna be looking behind my shoulder the rest of the video now. Sizzlipede, Nicket, <laughs> Chubbies. <laughs> Absol reverse and a lichen rock regular hollow. Uh, Pocahondro, no, we haven't gotten anything too crazy. We got a um, a Pierce Rainbow Rare, so that was pretty cool. Uh, we got two reverse fire energies, which I'm all about the reverse energies, especially the fire. So, uh, pretty pumped about that. But nope, no Zards yet. It's okay though. We got. Uh, if we don't get any Zards out of this stack, we got five more boxes to open. So, uh, I want this Zard and I want it bad. One, two, three, four. Watch the last pack be the Zard. Bailey says metal.
Metal and dark. I'm going to say fire. Oh, metal it is. Bailey, you are back. Had a rem. Rotom phone. Turfield Stadium. Roly Coley. Galarian Zigzagoon. Weedle. Purloin. Pokeball. Hop reverse. And a Marnie regular rare. All right, so we're down to the last three packs. All right, Ryan, sounds good, man. Thanks for jumping in. Uh, we'll, st we'll still be here probably when you come back. Um, so we got the Galarian um, Obstagoon next. Get your energy guesses in. Rolling coal on the front. I like it. All right. Energy is lightning, says Bailey. White Lotus, Twitch TV, what's going on, man? How are you? Thank you so much for jumping in. I appreciate it. Welcome to the channel. So we got lightning and fire. I'm going to go with Leaf. White Lotus says Dark. Rob, by the time you see it, your guess will be in. And it's Water. Drive safe, by the way. Charles, my boy. What's up, man? Roly Coley. Galarian Zigzagoon. Weedle. And Rob, you were right, dude. Water, water, water. Charles and Rob. Weedle, Purloin, Pokeball, Marnie Reverse, and an Eldegross V again. Wah, wah, wah. Charles, I'm going to pick up something for you tomorrow. Uh, I hope you're ready for when I drop it off to you because... Surprise, we are heading out to Arizona Tuesday morning. So I will be stopping by probably Wednesday or Thursday and giving you something. So I hope you'll be there. Let me know if you won't and we'll have to figure something out. So, all right, two packs left. Get your energy guesses in. We're going to go Gardevoir and then uh, Galarian Obstagoon. And hopefully we pull some heat out of this. Hey, Rob, real quick though, while I'm waiting for you guys to throw in your guesses. Um, have you seen any of these or have you used them? I picked these up at one of my LGSs and they're actually pretty good. Um, they slide into card savers and stuff a lot better. So if you see them, I, I recommend them. Like I, I feel like they're just as on point with, uh, um, with ultra pros. Who am I heading out with? Uh, me and my wife, we are going to um, Arizona to visit family for Christmas. So we she hasn't been home in probably about a year. So it's going to be super fun. White Lotus, are you going to Vapes and Capes? That's how you found me? I don't know if I'll, I, I'm going to try and make it by Vapes and Capes for sure. I'd love to meet some of you guys that I haven't met yet. Um, I was there probably a couple weeks or back in November. I did my first live stream actually in their podcast. So, um, so we got fire, we got lightning, water, and psychic, and Tyler. I don't know if you're calling both, but we'll go with that. So let's see who the winner is. I'm going to say fire. Oh, I don't think anybody said leaf. Leaf gets no love. Pokemon Center Lady, Vistini, Kabu, Ekans, Weedle. Galarian Lanoon, Scraggy, Roly Coley, Lipard Reverse, and an Altaria Regular Hollow. Oh man, down to the last pack. Pack 44 of 44. Thanks man, I appreciate it. Yeah, it's going to be a long drive, so we're heading out from the Colorado Springs area. Um, it's about 12 hours and we are taking all four of our dogs. Uh, we have four pit mixes, so it's going to be 
fun to say the least. Um, it's probably going to take us about, I would say, anywhere from 14 to 15 hours. So, but you know, it's going to be an adventure. You doing anything crazy for the holidays, Rob? Bailey says fighting. I'll wait to reveal it for some of you guys to get your answers in. BB Hawks, yeah, they are the Beckett sleeves. So my local game store had a couple of them. Um, and yeah, so I just decided I'd try them out. They're a little bit more expensive than the Ultra Pros. I think I paid like $1.75 for them, but I like them. Uh, if I had the two, like if I had Ultra Pros and Beckett's next to each other, I wouldn't go out of my way to get the Beckett's, but they're definitely nice. Um, yeah, we can definitely do that, BB Hawks. Uh, Lotus is saying fire. Rob saying fire. Yes, last lax, la, last pack heat for sure. We need that. Um, yeah, full car for sure. Ariel says dark, and Poke Chubby says water. I'm going to go with fire for that last pack heat. Oh, Ariel with the win. I don't know if that was Ariel or if it was Aiden, but good call. Absol, great ball. Rotom phone. Roly Coley. Sizzlipede. Purloin. Scraggy. Pokeball. Pierce reverse. And a Calarian Obstagoon. Oh, guys, I thought we were going to get it, but have no fear because I did, I do have more boxes ready to go. I wasn't sure if we were going to have to open these, so I didn't pre-open them. Um, but I'm going to get started on that right now. Um, Rob, are you doing anything crazy for the holidays, or are you just going to kind of kick it with family? Yeah, it's always a letdown when you don't get the card you want, but I mean, we did get some good stuff, so I'm not going to complain. Um, Could have been worse. Champion's Path is brutal, as we all know, so um, I go into it knowing full-heartedly that I'm not guaranteed to get anything crazy, and if we do, awesome, but I kind of, I kind of consider Pokemon cards, like as adults, like legal gambling, in a sense. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's super fun just to rip packs, obviously you know. Um, but it's obviously way better when you pull the card you want. I'm still chasing the Zard from Burning Shadows. Um, that card has eluded me for years. Bruh, a thousand packs. That's going to be nuts. The most I've ever opened at one time, I think, is like maybe 150. Are you going to plan on doing that in one stream? Or are you going to... Um, you going to kind of break it up. And everybody in here that is into this, into Pokemon openings and stuff like that, Polish Rob's a good dude. He's a lot of fun on his channel. Um, definitely throw him a subscribe and check out some of his videos. He's got a lot of knowledge. He goes up, he kind of does pack openings and then like just random things going on within the Pokemon TCG community. So definitely show him some love. It, I'd appreciate it. So we got three boxes down. We got two more to open real quick. One day stream. Jeez. Better wear some gloves or something, man. Your finger's gonna be bleeding.
But I mean, that's the goal for me at one point. I want to be able to rip a thousand packs live. So um, definitely write down some pointers for me and let me know how it goes. <laughs> But that's dope that you're going to be able to see family. I know it's really hard right now, depending on where you are in the country, to uh, be able to make that happen. So definitely, definitely stoked that you're able to make it work. All right. Mix these up. Yeah, the voice. Try maple syrup. Drink some maple syrup. Old pro tip from singing. If you don't believe me, Google it. It kind of coats your vocal cords, and uh, you won't get that rasp to your voice. But that's going to be rough for sure, man. Hats off to you. Uh, I'll definitely be jumping in and out of that. So I want to see um, what you pull. I do need to buy some of my cards from you, though. So going to have to redeem myself from that Unified Minds break you just did. One, two, three, four. Um, I didn't give you time to guess the energy, so we'll do it on the next one. Metal energy, Milo, Great Ball, Absol, Machop, Galarian Zigzagoon, Vulpix, Rockruff, Purloin, Scraggy Reverse, and a Scrafty Regular Hollow. Starting this one off just like we started the last ones. All right. Get your energy guesses in. I am going to say fire. Bailey is going to say fire. Seventeen likes. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, man, the Scrafty Squad is definitely coming out to play tonight. All right, I'm guessing fire. Oh, psychic. Sonia, Sharpedo, Rob. Yeah, no, I definitely think it is. Um, full heal. I actually was able to procure a booster box of it because I don't have one for my collection. So I collect booster boxes and ETBs. So um, yeah, I, I've i been trying to find one and one of my buddies here who's a local game store owner, um, he was able to hook me up with one. So I'm super pumped. I'm gonna actually be picking it up tomorrow. Carvana, <laughs> Scrafty Squad again. I feel like we need to make a meme for Scrafty. Champions Path, all creamy VMAX on the front. All right, guys, get your get your energy guesses in. I am gonna say fire because that's what we do here. We go for fire. While I'm waiting for you guys to get your energy guesses in, I'm gonna take a drink. Tyler says fire. Bailey says dark. Ariel says water. Fire. Uh, water it is. Nice job, Ariel slash Aiden. Kaboo. BB Hawks. Yeah, man. Nobody shows love for the leaf. Purloin. Pokeball. Inke. Galarian Zigzagoon. Trubbish. Machoke. Reverse. And an Alteria Hollow. Come on, Charizard. Where you at? All right, let's go lightning energy on this one. Rob, other than Hidden Fates, what is your favorite set? Man, Ariel, Aiden is a, he's a pro at guessing these. Uh, I'm going lightning. You want me to French a couple of them, Andy? I'll give this next one a nice big lick for you. How about that? Bailey says leaf. 
<laughs> Poor Venusaur. Yeah. He never really gets any big love. It's always Charizard and Blastoise. 100%. But I mean, like, even as a kid, like, I can't tell you how many Venusaur cards I got, and I could not wait to trade them away. However, I wish I would have kept on kept a couple of them. Um, so I'm going Lightning. And it's Psychic. Spoiler alert, there's something in the back. Sharpedo. Arbok. Potion, Galarian, Lanoon, Nicket, Machop, Ekans, Pierce, Reverse, and a Venusaur V. Would you look at that, BB Hawks? We talk about it and it appears. So we just need to keep talking about the Charizard. Just tell me something about. Tell me your favorite Pokemon, your favorite Charizard, BB Hawks. I feel like you know we talk about it and one will appear. Uh, Rob, Unbroken Bonds is dope. I, I figured you were going to say that based on the um, Rainbow Rare Zard and Reshiram that sits in the background of most of your videos. Um, that is another booster box I'm trying to attain, but it is not the easiest thing to get your hands on right now for a reasonable price. Um, <clears throat> but... Yeah, Unbroken Bonds is a dope set. I love all the tag team stuff. It's super cool. My favorite Charizard is Pokemon. There we go, yes. All right, Andy, this is for you, my dude. I'm gonna give Dreadnought VMAX a nice big lick, and that means that we're gonna pull some heat. So, let's get it. Bailey says Fire Energy. I'm gonna double that. I'm gonna Fire Energy that as well. One, two, three, four. And it is, oh, it is fire energy. All right, there we go. That's gotta mean something. The lick, the fire, Arbok, Hop, Vulpix, Machop, Rollin' Coal, Carvana, Potion, Nicket Reverse. <laughs> Man, this is what you call fire, Andy? Scrafty? Scrafty? Okay, yeah, Modern, Unbroken Bonds, Vintage, Team Rocket. Team Rocket's a very underrated set as well. Um, I didn't get a chance to open very many. Bailey, I hope. All right, let's, let's give Dreadnought another lick. There we go. Give us better luck, Dreadnought. Um, I didn't get to open much Team Rocket, but I do have, um, Hollow and a non-Hollow Dark Charizard, so that's super cool. Um, they're at PSA, and who knows when I will get them back. But, yeah, Team Rocket's a good set. I'd say Neo, either Neo Genesis or Neo Revelations is probably my favorite vintage set, other than base set. Um, I love the Shinings in those. I one one of the best um, pulls I ever pulled out of that was the the secret rare shining Raichu. So um, yeah, it kind of has kind of holds a place in my heart. Let's go fire! Oh, fire again! Yes, Rotom Phone, Malamar, Turfield Stadium, Rockruff, Purloin, Nicket, Sizzlipede, Hatiena. Hatterene Reverse, and a Machamp Hollow. Ah. Oh. Trust the tongue. <laughs> I'm over here about to get COVID off of these booster packs, licking them, just, to, just for your entertainment, Auntie. Are you entertained yet? I'm having a good time, though. This is so much fun. Uh, let's go Lightning. And it's fighting. Malamar, Sharpedo, Harbok, Nicket, Machop, Ekans, Swablu, Inke, Leapard, Reverse, and an Alcremie V. I like how my tone goes from like super high to and an Alcremie V. So I do have something planned after all of this Champions Path. I was able to find a good find at none other than Party City today. 
Um, so we will be getting into that after this. Oh, I bet you're loving it, Andy. You wish you were the packs right now, don't you? All right, let's go fire energy. And it's metal. Bailey said dark. You were wrong. Sorry, kid. Rotom Phone. Turffield Stadium. Vulpix. Galarian Lanoon. Full Heal. Purloin. Kakuna. Hatterim Reverse. And another Alcremie V. What the heck? It's making me hungry, though. Might have to go get me some cake after this. <laughs> oh, I bet you do, Andy. All right, Dreadnought again. And a Dreadnought after that. So we'll give him a lick, too. There we go. Come on, Dreadnought. Don't let us down. Hawks, yo, that's nuts. Only three white code cards, but you got three amazing rares? That's pretty crazy. I just have a soft spot for Charizard. Like I feel I have to I have to try it. Every time I see Champion's Path, I'm like, uh, I have enough of it. Nope, have to buy it. Yeah, the energy has to be fire on this one, Bailey. I'm right there with you. What uh what amazing rares did you get, Hawks? Let's go fire. E dark. Alright. Leapard. Team Yelgrunt. Aiden again with the win. Machoke. Vulpix. Trubbish. Rolling Cole. Galarian Zigzagoon. Weedle. Suspicious Food Tin. And a Duraludon V. I think this is a super cool looking Pokemon. Um, I'll be honest, I don't really know anything about it. Uh, but I love the artwork on it, so that's a pretty nice hit. It's it's a pretty good seller on TCG Player, too, so uh, not mad about that. Two Raikou, one Jirachi, one Full Art Leon, and a Colossal were your pulls. Honestly, out of 15 packs, that's not too bad. So... Um, that's what? A one and three. So pretty on point with the odds. Um, how many packs do I have left, Rob? I have two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I have ten packs left. I don't know if I guess the energy or not, but I'm going to say fire. Nope. We didn't move it yet. Everybody's going fire. All right, I, I like where you guys are at. I like where your head's at. Dark again, but that's okay. Malamar, Choke, Pokemon Center Lady, Vulpix, Potion. Amphro's V, so six hits out of 15. Yeah, that's not bad. Full heal, Roland Cole, Machop, Hyper Potion, Reverse, and a Galarian Obstagoon. But that's okay. I think we got three V cards in a row. So, got the giant kick topper up next. Pack six brings out the Zard. Okay, so that is. So we'll go two, three, four, five. This is the one you say is going to have the Zard in it. So we're going to put that right there. And then once we get done with these three, we're going to hit that one. Bro, if you call this, I'm going to. I'm probably going to throw my computer over. So, sorry if the stream goes down. I'll do my best to get it back up, but I'll, I'm going to freak out. It's been a hot minute since I pulled a Zard. From Champion's Path, at least. Fire energy. I got to stick with fire. E, water. Great ball. Pokemon Center Lady. Team Yelgrunt. Galarian Zigzagoon. Rockruff. Full Heal. Scraggy. Ekans, Lipard, Reverse, and an Altaria, Regular Hollow. All right, Galarian Obstagoon. 
Hey Rob, I know you you open a lot of Champions Path. Have you come across anywhere that tops were like slightly open still? We had like three or four packs earlier that were like that, but I mean we got pretty decent hits out of them, so I don't think they were tampered with. I think it was just like a factory crimping error or something. Um, be curious to hear what you have to say about that, or if you've experienced it. Fire energy, let's go. Lightning. All right, Bailey. Sonia, Rotom Bike, Sharpedo, Hadiana, Kakuna, Rockruff. This is a thick card. I wish you guys could feel this. Vulpix, Potion, Pierce Reverse, and a Hatterene Regular Hollow. All right. All creamy VMAX. Bailey, get your guess in. One, two, three, four. What's up, Ryan? Welcome back. All right. Let's... I'm going to say lightning. Bailey's going with metal. And it's water. Wah, wah, wah. Hop. Beedrill. Rotom phone. I've only had trouble with the boxes, not the packs. Yeah, I... So... I had one box that was like a purple, like a darker purple like this. And then I had another one that was like a pink. So I think that's how you can distinguish the different print runs on them. Um, Cause, oops. Because, uh, yeah, I have a bunch of them sitting here below me that I got like probably a month ago and they're like the dark purple um and most of these that i opened today were the the light pink so galarian lanoon full heel purloin kakuna trubbish great ball e and a waylord v Hey, so you're opening a thousand Champions Path packs. Are you are you sourcing those from ETBs or boxes? Cause that's a lot of boxes, a lot of ETBs, man. Good grief. All right, Ariel, Aiden, Bailey, what is the next energy gonna be? I'm gonna stick with fire, just because I feel like I have to. One, two, three, four. Fire, fire, fire. Let's go, and it's metal. Oh, Tyler, you're back. Fade, Machoke, Galarian Lanoon, Full Heal, Purloin, Kakuna, Trubbish, Vulpix, Reverse, and a Scrafty Regular Hollow. I would love to see your floor after you're done opening all the boxes and the packs, man. <laughs> I know the the last video I filmed, the last live I did before this one, I think I opened like 64 packs and my floor was a sea of packs of wrappers. But doubles are good. I, I feel like I've had better luck with double boxes than I have with Hatterene boxes, but I, I haven't pulled a Zard out of either of them. Yo, Tyler. Bailey, your guesses are all one behind? <laughs> okay, stick with fire. Gotcha. Yeah, there's a latency with YouTube. So, um, what I'm doing right now, you'll see in 15 seconds. So, it's kind of hard to try and time these things. So, I have to, like, say it ahead of time. But, like, also right when I'm in the middle of saying something. But, I'm going to try and figure out a way to do that differently. But... Yeah, man, I did see that picture. Um, I meant to comment on it, but then I hit bad service coming back from the mountain yesterday. That looks nuts. So um, best of luck to your fingers and best of luck to your voice. <laughs> That's all I got to say, man. But I'll be there 100% to check it out. Um, I'm going fire, and it's psychic. Ryan coming in with the heat. 
Kabu, Lightbird, Pierce, Vulpix, Trubbish, Roland Cole, Galarian Zigzagoon, Weedle, Kakuna Reverse, and a Zygarde Regular Hollow. Alright, get your guesses in now, because by the time I get the pack open is when you'll probably be seeing this, and then I can get my guess in too. So this is the pack that Rob says is going to pull the heat. So this is pack number six of that stack. We have four packs left. After this, let's get it. Come on, Zard, where are you hiding? Come out and play. Gotcha. So Bailey's saying fire, Ryan saying metal, Ariel saying water. I'm going to stick with fire. Oh, Bailey's saying green now. All right. I'm saying fire, and it's dark. That's okay, BB Hawks. Coming in with a win on that round. Rotom Phone, Turfield Stadium, Scraggy, Rock Rough, Vulpix, Galarian Lanoon, Full Heal, Inke Reverse, is Rob a magician? Is he right? Oh, and it's a hit, though. It's a Lucario V, so technically not wrong when you said that the six pack was going to have a hit. Wasn't the Zard. This is still a really good hit. So, I feel like Lucario doesn't really get a whole lot of love anymore either. Um, but that's just a super cool card. It almost, I think it's supposed to be a city in the background, but it almost kind of looks like internet-y so i will say i'm a little disappointed with champion's path tonight i was really hoping we were gonna rip that zard open i mean we still can we got four more shots so next up is an all creamy v max yeah man how many zards you feel like you're gonna pull in that opening i'm gonna i'm gonna say you're probably gonna get at least 10 One, two, three, four. Bailey saying water. I'm saying fire. Ooh, Bailey's right. Bailey hasn't been right in a while, so that means we might have some heat. Pierce, Swablu, Kakuna, Pokeball, Machop, Hadiana, Trubbish, and Machamp. Hawks, uh, literally 100%. So I'll, like, my wife and I will go to Target or, like, the PX, for example, to grab one thing. I'm like, oh, I'm going to go look for Pokemon cards real quick. And I end up walking out with 10 boxes of something. So, yeah, I definitely, I cannot, ch like, pick and choose um, what to buy. Like, especially if it's hot sets, I'll buy it all because I know in some way, shape, or form, like, I'm going to get a return on it. Or also, it's something that I needed for my collection. It is very dangerous, though, 100%. That's why I decided to start a business for it, so my personal bank account doesn't have to cry as much. Uh, Bailey's going with fighting. Yeah, Rob, that'd be dope if you get uh, one every hundred. I mean, those are supposed to be the odds, I think. Uh, last time I checked, they might have changed. So Bailey's going with fighting on this one. One, two, three, four. And it's dark. You bought half a target yesterday with Vivid Voltage and went back, the other half was gone. Yeah, I've definitely had that happen before. So a couple weeks ago... Um, I was at Walmart, one of the few Walmarts that stocks Pokemon cards here, and they usually never have anything. And I checked and I was like, yo, this place is stacked today. So I didn't have a cart with me stupidly, but I grabbed a handful of Vivid Voltage and some Unbroken Bonds. Um, these things right here, because I want another Reshiram Charizard. But, and then I went to go grab a cart and I came back and there was at least, um, at least 10 or 15 of like the racks, like the long racks like this, that are just sticking out of the wall. There was at least 10 or 15 of those full with three pack booster packs. And I came back and they were all gone. So, I mean, that 
that's at least like two or three hundred booster packs right there that somebody just swiped. But I felt really stupid, and now every time I go into a Walmart or a Target, I definitely grab a cart right off the get, even if I feel like they're not going to have anything. Just because I don't want that to happen to me again. Rock Rough, Professor's Research, Reverse, and an Altaria Regular Hollow. All right, guys, coming down to the last two packs, we are still hunting for that Zard. Um, he has eluded us so far. Maybe I should... I'm going to rub this Zard's belly real quick. Come on, buddy. Don't you want a friend? I know you want a friend. All right. Give us the luck, shiny Charizard. Ryan says fire. Aiden says fire. Bailey says fire. There we go, guys. I love the energy. Big fire energy. That's what we need right now. Tyler says fire. All right. Fire. Ooh, water. All right. Next one's going to be fire. 100%. It's got to be. Hatterim. Scraggy, Ekans, Kakumna, Nicket, Swablu, Sizzlipede, Reverse, and a Zygarde. Ugh, Zygarde. We have enough of you. We don't need any more. We only have two shiny V Charizards. We need more of him. All right, last pack magic right here, right now. Fire energy, we need it. Light up the chat. One, two, three, four. All right. Obviously, everybody's going with fire on this one. Oh, and it's leaf. But that's okay, because we can still get a fire reverse, right? Rotom Phone, Turfield Stadium, Vulpix, Trubbish, Roly Coley, Galarian Zigzagoon, Weedle, Nicket Reverse... And a Machamp. Oh, Champion's Path, you let me down. Um, so, Rob, on this one, it was centering. I did actually get a black label. Um, and I did just send it off to PWCC for their January auction because I want to... I want to kind of take that, whatever that gets, and throw it back into this so I can put out some mega content. So I send them both in at the same time, and this was like my sacrificial lamb because it was a little bit off on the centering. The other one looked perfect, but I had this one on top and I sent it to Beckett, and sure enough, the black label, like my other one came back a black label, and this one came back a 10, which like literally the odds of that happening is just stupid like I, I couldn't believe it like <clears throat> i was expecting punk to walk in with video cameras and be like haha just kidding like it's not really a black label it's just a sticker but um but yeah so i got very lucky with that at the time there were only nine of them now i think there's like <clears throat> 28 but i mean that's still super low population Yeah, I'm probably going <clears> to... <throat> Hawks, yeah, the Black Label. So, it's really hard to get, like, a gold BGS-10. But it's extremely hard to get a Black Label 10. So, uh, they're very, very, very snobby when it comes to grading anything a Black Label. Just because they want to... I feel like the company, the grading companies, want to keep those populations super low. Um... But yeah, I mean, this one sells between like the last. I haven't looked in a while because I don't plan on getting rid of this one. Um, this one sells for when I was, last time I looked, like anywhere from like a thousand to like thirteen hundred was what they were going for. And the black label, I saw one on eBay that went for fifteen OBO. Um, so I'm assuming it was probably a little bit less. And before that, it was like ten. But yeah, I'm sad to see it go, but if it's gonna help the channel grow and help me put out better content and bigger pack openings and stuff like that, I'm all for it. Um, because eventually I'll pull another shiny V. So <clears throat> anyways, we are not done on our Charizard hunt because I was able to find four of these Burning Shadows single pack blisters with the uh, Jing Momo. Jeng Mo'o 
promo on the front of it. So we can pull the Rainbow GX out of this. I have not pulled this card yet, and I have probably opened a thousand, or not a thousand, at least three to four hundred Burning Shadows packs over the last couple years, and I have not pulled it. <clears throat> oh, you sent off a Zacian and a Rylabloom? Um, that's good luck, man. Um, were they from Shiny Star V or were they from uh, the American sets? Um, because if they're from Shiny Star V, you have, probably have a really good chance of getting one because, you know, Japanese cards are immaculate. But, um, yeah, it's going to be a fun auction. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to stream it live, like stream the auction live and just kind of watch the auction and then film my reaction of my card selling. It's going to be very bittersweet. There might be some tears. There might be some screaming, some yelling, some jumping for joy. Um, who knows? It's going to be it's going to be fun. But, anyways... Let's rip these open real quick. See if uh, see if the if the Rainbow GX is in here. Um, that would literally make my day. Oh, code card for somebody. Okay, base sword and shield and dark displays. Gotcha. Um, from what? Personally, I mean, I feel like those sets both had really good print quality, so I feel like it should be solid. Um, I mean, you've been at this game for a while, so you know 100% of at least what what you want to send in. So I'm sure you'll probably at least get a 10, 9.5 or 10. But keep it, keep me posted on that, man. Um, I'd be interested to see what you get back. Uh, is Burning Shadows three from the back? I think it's four from the back still. Um, let's find out. Dark. And it's a metal. Dang, I'm so used to Champion's Path and Vivid Voltage because that's all we've been opening. These cards look so foreign to me. Horsey. Cutie Fly. Ladybug. Noibat. Stuffle. Turtonator. I thought it said Turntonator. And I was like, yo, this dude's getting turned up in here. And what is that? What is that, Pokemon? You've got to be kidding me. We're getting trolled hard by now, hard right now by Turntonator. All right, Burning Shadows number two. Something's got to be waiting in one of these packs. Like we got it. We got to pull some heat tonight in some way, shape, or form. Another green, okay. Bailey saying water, I'm gonna say fire. One thing that I don't like about Burning Shadows is the print quality. Oh, bro. I was looking at picking up one of those. Um, I'm definitely gonna get in on that opening because you're gonna pull Zard for me, all right? Bet, right now. I'll buy the whole case from you. <laughs> uh, I'm going to say fire. And it's a grass. That's going to be a huge deal, man. Gloom. This is me right now. I'm super gloomy because I want his art. Sneasel. Charmander's a good sign. Crab Crawler. Meow. Stuffle. Olivia Reverse. And a Ladian non hollow. It's okay, we got two more packs. I feel like something is there. Let's get some fire emojis in that chat right now. Because we're about to be on last pack magic after this one. Burning Shadows, you've let me down so much in the past. Can you redeem yourself? And if you can, right now is the time to do it. Ah, okay. That's going to be sick. So, I'm super pumped for that. I definitely think that... Well, not think. These are definitely not first print rot. Oh, I know, man. Have you pulled the... The shiny... Or the rainbow GX yet in this set? Or are you still chasing it, too? 
I think I just did the card trick. I can't remember, but I'm going to say fire. Leaf again. Hoot Hoot, Rhyhorn, Ralt, Tangla, Wick, Reverse, and a Weevil, Regular Hollow. I mean, we've just opened three of these, and we've gotten green code cards in each one of them. Actually, I don't even think we got a code card in this one. Oh yeah, we did. Right there. Are you going to have the, the white card? All right. Come on, Marshadow. Hey, we got a white code card. Okay, first good sign. Bailey says psychic. Dang, six booster boxes. My dude, oh, that's rough. Yeah, I, I feel that. I, I have... Four Burning Shadows ETBs behind me, but I don't want to open them just because, like, I feel like they're better served staying sealed, and somebody else would have better luck to pull the Zard than I would. Um, I'm going to say Fire, and it's a Grass, but that's okay. We got a White Code card, so that means we should get at least a Hollow, but... That Rainbow Rare GX Zard is sitting in the back, waiting to be brought into the light. I just feel it. Oh, and it's a Machamp GX. That's okay, though. I don't have this card, and this is actually pretty dope looking. Surprisingly, I don't have this card, with how much of Burning Shadows I've opened. Should we do one more Champion's Path double or Hatterene box? I have a... F I think I can make that happen. Let me know what you guys want me to do. You think you think it's worth it? Or should we just call it a night and cut our losses? This print... This one actually looks really good. The centering on this is... Pretty... Damn perfect. Left to right, good. Top to bottom, it's a very little top heavy. The back, however, we got whitening on the top and along this side right here. Centering's a little top heavy and a little right heavy. But, you know, it's better than a regular rare, non hollow. But, all right, I will give the people what they want. We want one more box. So, let me grab one. The cut looks really good on it. Um, it's just a little top heavy on the front. But the back, um, not the best. All right. Double is going to be our final box of the night. We want that Zard. And I feel like it's in here. This box doesn't want to be open. That must mean something. Yeah, no, that definitely makes sense why that Zard goes for as much as it does. Here, somebody want a double box card? There you go, chubs. Knock yourself out. Um, yeah, makes 100% sense why it goes for so much. And that's what, like, I try to explain to people when I'm, like, trying to educate them on graded cards and stuff. They're like, oh, my God, you're kidding me this much for, like, for a piece of cardboard? And I'm like, yeah, but you got to think about it. Like, collectors are diehard, and, like, they'll pay for what they want. 
but it has to meet certain criteria. And they're like, well, I have one of those. Does that mean that it's worth this much? It's like, well, no, um, because there's this factor, this factor, this factor. And you try and explain like centering and edges and stuff like that. And they're like, what? They don't get it. But yeah, this one, I don't know. Hold on. Let me pull it out really quick. Yeah, it's really hard. You won't be able to see it, but it looks like it was literally like lipped over. So back in a time where it didn't matter. They just wanted to get qual. They just wanted to get product out there. So which really surprises me with like the newer sets coming out, how like vivid voltage centering is so off on so many of them. Um, I don't know. I just don't get it. You'd think that quality control would be a little better. But, all right, let's get into All Creamy V first. I keep hitting my camera, so I'm sorry, guys. Dang, I wish all packs opened like that. That was nice. That was very satisfying. All right, one, two, three, four. I'm gonna go with fire. Hey, and it's fire. Lifeheart, Pierce, Team Yelgrunt, Potion, Fulpix, Inke, Pokeball, Sizzlipede, Sigard Reverse, Lycanroc Hollow. Heat incoming, hopefully, Rob. I need your guys' help, though. We need those fire emojis. I don't think Charizard has hurt us. So, I want to see the entire... Um, the entire chat from top to bottom with fire emojis. We got to go fire on this one. Let's go. Let's go. And it's Leaf. Absol. Great Ball. Yeah, Rob, you know what's up. Ekans. Kakuna. Nicket. Swablu. Machop. Machoke. Reverse. What do you bet this is a Machamp? Hey, and I like in Rock. Regular Hollow again. As if we didn't already have a hundred of you. All right, Dreadnaw. You know, just for old time's sake, for Andy, if you're still here. There we go. Giving Dreadnaw some love. I'm going to, of course, go with Fire Energy on this one. Bailey says metal. I'm gonna say fire. E, dark. Okay. Pierce. Sonia. Sharpedo. Naked. Chop. Ekans. Swablu. Inke. Vistini. Reverse. And an Altaria regular hollow. So, if offish is theory is right that means that this pack is gonna be the hit pack so come on Charizard give us give give yourself a friend code card Bailey says water. I'm going to say fire. And it's metal. Rotom phone. Absol. Great ball. Carvana. Swablu. Vulpix. Trubbish. Roly Coley. Ooh. 
I like that. In DJ Khaled terms, I like that. That's gotta mean something. Oh, and we got so trolled by this box. We got a Galarian Obstagoon as the last hit. Oh, but the fire energy, I will take it. However, this one is not as nicely centered as the other two we got tonight. So, Champion's Path has trolled us yet again. Um, such a brutal set. So, we just opened 68 packs of Champion's Path, and we did not pull a Charizard. So, that just goes to show you guys how difficult it really is to pull. Um, it's, it's not easy. So, um, we did get some decent pulls, though. So I'm excited about that. I'm just going to kind of sort them out real quick and then show you. Um, so for the reverse energies, we got not one, not two, but three reverse fire energies. We got a reverse psychic energy and a reverse dark energy. So... These are definitely going to be added to my collection. I'm probably going to send one of these two off to get graded just to sit alongside this guy right here. Um, and then for the big hits, we got a Machamp GX. We got a Lucario V. Waylord V. Duraludon V. All creamy V. I'll creamy V again. Venusaur V. Eldegross V. All creamy V again. Galarian Cursula V. Full Art. Galarian Cursula V. Graplock V. Cursula V. Incineroar V. Pierce Full Art Rainbow Rare, which is a super nice hit. Venusaur V. Graplock V. And Eldegrass V was the first hit of the night. So that's going to wrap up this video for tonight, guys. Thanks so much for hanging out on this Sunday. Um, Tyler, Bailey, Ryan, Aiden, Hawks, uh, Rob, thanks for stopping in, man. I appreciate you jumping in here and engaging and hanging out in chat. Uh, I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys did as well. Um, I probably, I'm going to try and do another video maybe tomorrow, like a quick brief live. Uh, before I leave, but I probably won't have another video out until after Christmas. Um, so just keep an eye on your notification button. If you've just been hanging out and you're not subscribed, definitely consider subscribing uh, so you can get notified every time I do go live. Uh, please consider hitting that like button. It really helps out the channel. Um, again, thank you guys so much. I had a lot of fun. Uh, Rob, if I don't see you before then or if you don't jump in before then, I will catch you in your next stream. Um, and guys, Show Rob some love. He's a good dude. Uh, puts out a lot of good content. So appreciate you all. Enjoy your Sundays. Have a good night. Have fun with your families. And I will catch you guys later.